Hey there and welcome to this week's commentary challenge. So the topic of this week is aliens with purple socks, suggested by 09ipal10, I think the nickname is supposed to be, <laughs> I don't know. If you want to have your challenge in this weekly series, just leave it in the comment section below and the weirdest, craziest, whatever as topic will be chosen probably for next week. So yeah, let's get this started. Aliens with purple socks. First of all, I believe in aliens. I don't believe in, I don't know, independent style aliens. I just don't think that uh, another race of beings would or creatures would come to this planet after millions and millions of light years just to invade us. That would be kind of pointless. So yeah, I think there are creatures out there, but we just have no clue how they are, what they are, what they look like. But now we got a little clue. They need to have feet. You know, socks without feet are kind of useless. Why would you invent socks if you don't have feet? That's... No, it doesn't make any sense at all. And don't tell me that they could just wear it on their hats, for example. That just doesn't make sense because you would call it hats then and not socks. No, you don't do that. So yeah, we got aliens with purple socks. And the thing is... The thing that first struck me was the fact that if that's the only noticeable feature about them, that they have purple socks, they gotta be really important for their whole species, for their whole planet. Maybe they got some historical value, you know? Purple socks, if we analyze what they probably could mean, it means that their planet might be, I don't know, wet? Or that they need to, I don't know save their feet from the sun because, I don't know, purple color might block the sun. I have no idea if that actually works. But yeah, purple socks, they would actually have a great purpose if you want to come to this planet. Because imagine this, imagine hundreds and hundreds of battleships all around our atmosphere, all around our big cities. And of course, we would ask ourselves, are they here to invade us or are they here in peace? And the moment they show themselves, we would know basically nothing. You know, they would stand in front of us and we would see their purple socks and we'd be like, damn, what the frick does that mean? Because purple basically is a color that's made up of two colors. It's blue and red. And blue is a color for deep thoughts and sadness. And red is a color for anger and love. So totally mixed signals. You would have absolutely no clue what they mean. They could be here just to show us love, to be friendly, to be peacefully. They could be here to, you know, bomb us back to the middle age because of the other meaning of the red color. They could be here because they feel sad, because their planet was exploded, because they're all Superman. I have no idea. Maybe they come from Krypton. We have no idea. Or they could be here because they want to share their wisdom with the universe. We just wouldn't know. So yeah, right after they invaded us, we would probably know what they were up to. But up to that point, purple socks would be so confusing and the whole human race would probably collapse just because of the fact that they couldn't figure out why the frick they are wearing purple socks. But on a related note, did you know that purple is actually the color of grieving or yeah, sadness in general? You know, the Catholic Church ruled the color purple for, you know, it's better than black to wear at a funeral, for example. They did that a couple of years back. So maybe that's a sign that that's just a kind of an emo alien species. You know, they're sitting around all the time and they're like, oh my god, my life is so crap. I just got this crappy warp engine. Oh, my life is so sad. I don't know. They could be emo aliens. That would be actually kind of funny if you imagine them with the makeup and the hair and purple socks. But yeah. Oh, and of course, purple is, that's even more important, is the color of sexual frustration. If you didn't know that, if a woman wears purple, she's probably sexually frustrated. The only other reason could be that purple is just the color of the year. But yeah, we won't go that way because that argument is so invalid. But yeah. Purple is the color of sexual frustration, so if you have aliens that always run around with purple socks, they might be really, really sexually frustrated. Maybe they have a whole history of being sexually frustrated. Maybe their whole species is built on the thought that they are sexually frustrated. And you know what? If you read any kind of story about alien abductions, it always ends up with someone being anally probed. So... Might that be the reason? Are those aliens so sexually frustrated that they scavenge around all the universe and they're just searching for planets with people that have holes or with species that have holes so they can put their purple socks in there? Is that the reason why they go around the universe and anally probe anything that lives? That could be a reason. If you really think about it, it makes sense after all. So aliens with purple socks could be the reason that so many people get fucked in the butt by aliens. 
yeah, think about it. Really think about it. This is some deep shit. So, <laughs> yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this commentary about Aliens with Purple Socks and this week's commentary challenge. If you did, leave a comment and a rating, of course, and subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. And that was it. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm Lost Link, signing out. Oh, 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 oh.